Leon's insurance, how can I help? <laughs> We're either gonna what? be back in the classroom Don't or someone's gonna anybody. fuck up. Bet. Hey, watch it. Knew it. Huh? Leon used classroom. How did we get it? Hey, Chris. What? What just happened? Yeah, pfft, fuck like, if I know. Wasn't, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? It sure fucking felt real. Hmm. Anyway, as I was saying, just tell us if we couldn't find any joke. Let's explore a bit. It's a yellowed, poorly drawn picture of a green turtle. It's signed Alvin. It's a light switch. Looks like the interpretive art of Squidward. <laughs> it does! It's a worn down stuffed animal. Chum. It's a checkerboard. There are pawns strewn on it. Would well, I make it a chessboard? But I'm ch Man, sounds very sudden. That must have been real then. Time passed. Everyone else was going on by now. I guess that was somewhere better than us goes next time, huh? Yeah. Well, I guess we should go. So this then begs the question, is this wardrobe essentially going to be some kind of portal to the underground? Are we in, are we in some kind of Narnia situation? Oh no, I guess we'll find out. You shall see me. Because it was part of me that was like thinking like something would go wrong and we'd end up like waiting all these years for all these chapters to release and like a decade after the game came out we come back to the classroom and everyone collected the goes. That's where we started, I forgot. <laughs> Which would have been the longest game and would have been awesome. Chris? Yeah. Hey. Let's go back there tomorrow, alright? Why not? So it is a Nani situation. Yippee. Door is locked. Now you're just afraid to explore around? Door is locked. Um, oh, these are the same Oof, before, yeah. <laughs> what do you say? Let me guess, it's locked. Oh, no. There's flowers. It's a bunch of roses. Nice. The computer is turned off. Everything felt peaceful for a moment. Looks like motivational quotes from various literature. Try your best, Astral Wolf, even in your darkest hour. That one seems to be from a video game. Bunch of anime <laughs> um, motivational quotes. Check yeah, the time. Oh, yeah. It seems to not be time for class. Really? You don't say. You run the water fountain. It's lukewarm. Do you like breathing? I love breathing. Leaving fast with or without legs? Hell yeah. But usually with legs. Join the cross country team with Jockington and Noel. Locker. It's locked. Ooh. There's Toriel's. Hey! Calls. Some kind of primitive sculpture who knows what it represents. The throne of gods. The chair stack. Kids' books. Some of them used to be yours. Ah. Oh. It's a poster of several basic shapes. Circle, oval, square. Hypododecahedron. <laughs> you know, just the just the usuals. Some kind of teacher food. Some kind of teacher food's a fucking apple. <laughs> it's a computer. It's just some wallpapers you and your brother dressed up for Halloween eight years ago. Aww. Who's my brother? It's Toriel. It's written in Ezreal. cursive on the dry erase board. Oh, uh, yeah. Azrael is your, like, is Toriel's child, so, yeah. Oh, that's right. I thought... I'm still not quite sure this is a relationship to... university. I'm still not... And Azrael, that was the guy we fought at the end of Undertale, right? Yeah. I'm talking with names. Fl Flowey's... Flowey's true form. Yep. Yep. Hey. All right. So uh, okay. Um. But we'll, okay, we'll get to that. I'll get to that in a second. Anyway, apple. That's really? more of a doctor's food. Teacher's food. <laughs> uh. All right. No, that, that's that's a doctor's worst nightmare. <laughs> true. Let's get out of here. Ring, ring. Uh, Chris. Uh, 
Whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I am afraid I'm going to have to punish you. I'm sorry. Huh? A friend? Yeah. You were spending time with a friend. What fucking friends do you- <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe this kid actually made a friend, what the fuck? How much did you pay her? Oh my god. <laughs> you didn't steal my wallet, did you? <laughs> you can continue our adventures a little longer. Oh, just want to make sure you guys all got your checks from my mum to continue being friends with me? Yep. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah. Did you return home? <laughs> I'm going to have to go to bed early. Aww. See you soon, honey. Alright. Click. Hey, Mum, we went to your old house. I mean, your old anyway. place of... Oh, uh, fucking... Let's walk! <laughs> your classroom. The you light red ruby. The town. Yippee! Uh, Chris, what's up? Caddy's working, so I'm gonna st I'm starting our, pro our project. I've already copied a bunch of pictures. It's the same picture of a soccer ball 73 times. Timmy! Oh, no, She's reading a comic full of hot demon guys. Oh my god. Teens only. Very good <laughs> As an anime review, read it. <laughs> no, 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 no! Oh my god, no, no, don't make me read no, a review! No, no. Um, I'm scared, but sure. Teens Corner Monthly Teen to Interview, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie 2. This reviewer had Mew Mew 2 as her first exposure to the series, and let her tell you it makes Mew Mew 1 look like a dumpster with sparkly cat ears. With a darker storyline and more mature themes, the second one treats the viewer like a real adult, instead of like an animal that will die if it goes 10 seconds without seeing a beach ball. Not to mention, Mew Mew's character is the first one, is more stable than the ramen I eat at home by myself with the lights off. Teens and elders should check out this dark masterpiece. Signed, the anonymous yellow. I knew Alphys would write that. <laughs> Hello, buddy. I love reading books, especially the book upstairs. You really should read them. Well, let me up there. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna fucking go up. Lord of the Hammer, first in the award winning fictional series by lauded historian Gerson Boone. Please remember my name, please. I read a book to hell, you remember? My hot spy guy. <laughs> hot spy oh, guy. <laughs> it's an unlabeled book, you look inside. Oh, I accidentally returned my personal That's journal instead of- Oh, sorry. Who's this? It's Naps the Bloke. Ah! That was- Hold on, it's not- Oh, I accidentally returned my personal journal instead of my book. What the fuck? Oh no, I put it into- Oh, they're kind of- Naps the Bloke is so sad, just ask to say you handed the wrong book. You know, I have to take it out every time I want to write a new entry. <laughs> There's a book in here, you look at the page. It's delicious! This must be what they meant by flavor text. <laughs> um, Chris, you survived Susie? I was getting worried. Um, now you can finally pay off your family debt. Um, how to draw dragons is 2,582 days overdue. However, Chris, I'm a benevolent volunteer assistant. If you turned in this week, I would just your fine too. I'm yeah, forty-six dollars and twenty-three cents. Consider it, Chris. I love the wide face. Computer lab, please search the web responsibly. In fact, maybe don't do it at all. That's good fucking advice. You look through the window to the computer lab. There seems to be a dog inside working on a computer. Toby! Seems like it's making a game. Ha <laughs> ha! Seems like I should interrupt it. Seems like when the game's finished, you can go in. You just have to trust the dog. You gotta trust the dog. Is that you meta? Trust Toby. Yeah, very. Mm. Mm. Um, hello everyone. Oh boy, town exploration. There's a lot to fucking explore here. Oh my oh. god. Oh, uh, let fuck it. Let's meander. Meander. Hello. It's locked. Does something happen when you call here, Heather? Or yeah. Call. <laughs> Ring, ring. Never mind, let's just call home. Alright, never mind. What is it? It's... What? No, I'm not giving you a ride home. <laughs> Your house is not far, it's just at the top of the town. Try walking! It builds character, honey! Hell yeah. Touch cross! Touch cross. You stay inside all day playing fucking video games, you nerd. 
It's funny because she drove the car at the start of the game. <laughs> Get off League of Legends. Yeah. What? Who's doing this? Uh, Chris. Chris, what a point. Listen to surprise to see you here. We're not on school day. Ah, uh, Judge! There must be a reason that you came here at such a time. Is it because I painted the glass windows like I just took LSD? <laughs> I, Father Alvin, implore you, if you have anything wait weighing on your mind, please speak. Yeah, someone's drawing fan on love you in the unused classroom. Frick, excuse me. <laughs> Chris, if you want some of our sick fruit juice, you should come to our service. No, they I'm good want this, They want the fruit juice. <laughs> they want the wine. <laughs> the fruit juice? Oh, choir sounds a bit thinner since your brother went away. I tried choir, stop for me, man. Slowly getting an alcohol. <laughs> Chris, it would be wonderful if you would sing with us. Or even participated to any extent. Uh. Instead of just trying to drink the fruit juice. I want wine! They Look, want man, one. I'm not that religious. They know what they want. Whoa. Is that okay. There? Gerson, renowned historian, author, and teacher, dead. So you Crystal. know the title from the title on Waterfall, the tortoise in the oh, old man. <gasps> oh, Crystal, snowy gemstone for a proud mother. That's Snowy. Snowy's mum. Oh, mother, a big bone for the leader of the pack. That'd be Endogony. Oh, Shara, a karaoke microphone for a brave singer. And that. That'd be, you know, Shiren. Actually, yeah. that would be lemon bread, yeah. Yeah, some Boom Memorial Bench. Throughout my career, some of my best ideas come from dreams. Pick a rest here if anyone asks. You're right. Oh, that's... I'm glad you were... your death was respected. What more to the town is there to explore? It's gonna the make town a, hall. Another horrible joke. Uh, hey. stuff. Why would you possibly need to talk to the mayor? No idea. Your allowance is too low. Ate too much candy, so lost your frisbee in the wash. Psst. Hey, no. no, not my frisbee. That's what the cops are for. <laughs> Alright then. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The mayor is busy right now. Fair enough. If you need to see her, please try causing some terrible crisis. <laughs> the mayor's charisma is about zero. No, it's negative. But. She works hard and has a good track record, so she runs on up unopposed. That's politics. Really. It's a chair. Maybe it's the politics. <laughs> that chair's got a politics fetish. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, this is, oh my god, there's so much. Oh my god, there's so much. Let's start here. Oh god, someone's actually here. Oh, this is pizza, your number one spot for a piping hot piece of pizza. Uh. Hey. Hey, wait a second. I don't remember the verse I had for you. Oh, no, it's you. <gasps> oh, buddy, it's me. Wanna chat for a minute before I lose my mind? Um, sure. You know when Azzy's coming home? You, you can tell him this, but I really miss the guy. <laughs> It'd be sweet to, to cruise around town like all the times. Picking up, for example. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Which is a matter of course. They that have actually happened. <laughs> 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 One time I didn't mean the right contact with me. <laughs> Look at his face! Well, she is for eating me a speeding ticket. <laughs> what you doing? What you doing for some time in front of our many 24 plus of flavors? We've got the armor. Food. Eyes. Food. Baby. Double eyes. Poor poor wellness. And more. Stop on a nice scene. Mmm. Poor fire. I thought you were going to do all 26 or something. No, go back. I'll oh, go back. The entrance is locked. No one's inside. Seems like all of the employees are outside in costume. So back of pants Here at Icy's same. Pizza, your family is going to love it. <laughs> oh, can I take you in my sweatsuit for a while and start working here because... 
Dr. Logan made me think I was a rascal slap. <laughs> but I ended up really loving my job, and my whole work is too, which is it. <laughs> nice. No, fuck me! Oh, I'm going back, I'm going back. I just pizza. <laughs> There's a lot to do in this town, it's fine. <laughs> uh, I see Pisa, your number one spot for piping hot Pisa Pisa. Hell yeah. There was more? Like burger pants. Yeah. Burger pants. I'm talking to burger pants. Oh, okay. Hey, little bit, what's up? Oh yeah, that's right, fuck, I forgot. <laughs> oh yes, little buddy, good idea, meet the rooms gallery. Blue areas, self self obsessed, no concept of personal space. Cheap sex gently pouring splashes on me and <laughs> giggling. I think they like you. Oh, we have good pizza related injuries. Constantly to profess your customs with watch bags. Oh my god. <gasps> Purple so, die! Yeah, that guy. You gotta. Actually, just a second. Okay. Uh. Oh. My co-workers, where would I be without them? Uh, um, is that a reference? A happy place for little buddy, a much happier place. And this one more. Job. <laughs> Make no mistake, little buddy. I see it's pizza as hell. What that sense? I thought for seconds without hearing. Dear T. Player, there's no lie in prison. <laughs> Guess the reason you just took it out. <laughs> well, it's okay, little buddy. I've been saving up. We go to college, or as it is. Hell yeah. And he's at university. <laughs> Did I get a theater degree? Because the babe is active. That's what they all say, buddy. <laughs> Even me. The fan girls roll in, little buddy. The fan girls ship you with the nice cream guy. <laughs> uh, no. It's right, little buddy. You don't have to watch me suffer. Enjoy your food about it, man. I think the dude with bunny ears is the nice cream guy. Yeah, I was gonna say, I was gonna say he's an ice cream guy. Oh. It's the same thing. Huh. Because, yeah, he, he wanted to work at the ice cream shop because... And also, cream. he loves burgers. <laughs> <laughs> Fanship's one. Right, me up, right, me up, boss. Oh, is it, alright, awesome. Is that Barney the Dinosaur? Hell yeah. Yes. Oh my! I'm gonna be here for a little while. <laughs> You're alive. Nice. I'm walking. <laughs> uh, we'll take the special. And do you have any edible glitter? The youngins won't well, won't eat anything if it doesn't look like treasure. Hey there! Haven't seen you in a while, hon. Hey, you're the rubber lady from Sunday. I Sunton. remember back on Sundays after service, you and your family would come in and order the special. Of course, things happen, and then y'all stopped coming together. But every Sunday, you and your brother would still come in. He'd order you a hot chocolate, and you could sit down at that table in the corner, drawing shapes in the window with your breath. You must really miss him, huh? What happened, did? Uh, Dad? Something about, I can't remember his name, the king? Hey, how about this? Asgore. Asgore, that's it. He's got the hot chocolate. I'm a house, huh? Nice, thank you. Jeez. Looking at my brother buddy, you must wonder what kind of secrets I hold. My secret is, I put all my leftover pancakes in this giant hat. <laughs> ice wolf does not like ice in blue. Ironic. Ice will think ice. Ice will flex ice. To be drinked. You know, honestly, just a glass of ice slaps. <laughs> that I shit hope if I would like to see you, maybe I should sign up too. Nah, seven drinks wouldn't really suit a fire elemental. That's fair okay. enough. If I got nervous, I'd just melt all the ice. Dude, Dude remember, remember when we- Oh, oh sorry. sorry. <laughs> Dude, remember when we used to skip the first hour of class to come here? You were fine, but- I almost had to repeat the year because of it. Those crepes are mad worth it, though. Delinquency is the best con 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 condiment. Oh my god, condiment. I can I can English. So, for you two girls, that'll be the crepes, a cinnamon latte, two bunny parfaits, and a piece of firewood. <laughs> Hell yeah. 
Oh, um, right. You go down this mall. Go down. Go. This way down? Go. <gasps> Sins! <laughs> hey, we're just walking around. Who are you, kid? I'm great now. Who the fuck are you? This is not. Especially considering I've never met you before. How do you know? Name's Sims. The Sims is skeleton. I'm new in town. What's up? You got me? Yeah, that's grocery store. Unfortunately, it's closed. Woo! What a pain. I really wanted to buy some milk. Um, <laughs> someone already complained to the guy who runs it. By the way, um, Zach, look at the. Look at the name. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so I'm saying this used to be Groovy's place. <laughs> yeah, he Groovy out. He Groovy out. Groovy left the comment in and just put an A and F after it. <laughs> With Sans. <laughs> we literally we just moved here, so I hardly know anyone. Why? Got anyone I should know better? Me. Um, me. Oh, that tiger. You can't just jump straight into friendship. Try me. It takes time. No, it won't. We're already best friends. <laughs> Alright, that's enough time. Called it. Take this. Can't just look. Can't just go alone. Take <laughs> this. Okay. Well, whenever you feel like it. Let's go! I got Sanjay's number! What's up? Friends, alright. My teacher. Elvis? Yeah, I know about her. Came into the store with a suitcase and sunglasses. There she was part of the mob. <laughs> he opened the case and stuffed it full of loose bills. Right. Hidden small bills. That's Elvis. Then slunk out of the place. Jammer's trailing on the floor. <laughs> Anyway, relationship is good to the business. Alright. Well, uh, uh, I guess just let him know. So I guess I want to do a thing. Uh, friends. My mom. Your mother, huh? Too late. I already befriended your mother last night. <laughs> <laughs> So I just I'm recreating the sound. <laughs> I really just got your mum by Sans, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank really you, thank had you, had Discord fucking... soundboard. Thank no, you. Trust, yeah. me, been, it, trust me, it would have been much better if I had the fucking skeleton hit from Minecraft. <laughs> uh, hold on. Uh... Please don't be have it. <laughs> Cry myself to sleep tonight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's great. Came to the store to buy jumper kisses. <laughs> Alright, sorry, did you read the line? Yeah, yeah dude. <laughs> well, said so she's gonna look her door to stop you from eating. <laughs> you sound like a little fun. You sound like a fun kid, huh? I reckon I'm a fun kid. Uh, wait, hang on. Nobody. He's a bit of a fun guy. Friends. Oh, I should put that. No! Leave. I mean, I'm not sure a bit of a fun guy. <laughs> so. Oh, we've got Nope, you've just run out of text options. Me too. Anyway, I'll be standing here doing nothing. Oh, great. Hey, bud. <laughs> Are you busy tomorrow? Nope. I need some help with something. I'll be there early. Could you wait to come over? Hell yeah. <laughs> I live just next door, you know. You could even have a sleepover, man. I don't care. Yes. Oh, you ain't so quickly, huh? You're a cool dude, Sans. That's not good. I'm a total stranger. Not at all, man. I should probably hesitate more. I don't care. Well, guess I shouldn't complain. Huh? What are you gonna what are we gonna be doing? Sex! Oh, <laughs> 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 oh I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be there. Aww. That'd be weird. 
What, for sex? Yes. It's just gonna be you and my little brother. Hello. That's what you respect, you fucking freak. He needs friends. Thanks for hanging out with him. I'll hang out with Paparis any day. Yeah. Knock, knock, knock. No response. But the distant trash of bones. I wonder what found. It's the joke of Paparis' theme, which is named Bone Trousel. Knock, knock, knock. Yeah, you live in Hulu and that lives in the top of town? I am. Yeah, well, my mommy tells me about you. Does it hurt to be made of blood? Nope. Knock, knock, knock. No, that sounds like the knock of the beginner. Come back when you've gotten better at knocking. Alrighty then. Oh my god, there's the so much. Woo, you're lucky, Chris. You got the miss class with Alphys. It's not fair. Ha <laughs> ha. If I skipped class, my dad would never let me hear the end of it. Ha ha ha. That's actually not even remotely funny. Let's knock on this door. Knock, knock, knock. Chris, no, what I tell you about knocking on the doors. Oh, oh. That's how he's dead. Alright. Don't do it. It's really gonna hurt your face. You don't have arms, you know. <laughs> yeah, Chris, you survived to me. <laughs> sure did. I mean, I never saw her beat up anyone up, but uh, I'd be careful. Fair enough. Like, one time, me, Snowy and Jumping were playing handball. How? <laughs> <laughs> it's just... actually called Faceball down here. <laughs> <laughs> and she just kept quickly watching us from the corner. Then, when the ball rolled over to her, she just started throw solids and kick the ball as hard as she could, ran into officers on Dyne's car. <laughs> oh, shit. And then my dad came out smiling, cracked the knuckles and totally wiped us at handball. It's like when, like, <laughs> the, it's like when the teacher comes in and joins handball. Hell yeah. <laughs> anyway, Susie sucks, Chris. <laughs> nah, she's just misunderstood. <laughs> What are you doing uh, uh, here, Alphys? Uh, Chris, Chris, you're okay. Are you making meth? I, I was really worried that when you didn't come back. Where did you go? Did you skip class? I went to the underground, man. Uh, well, don't worry about it. Welcome to the underground. I'm the cool teacher, you know? You're not in trouble. <laughs> I'm the cool teacher. Teach you me, please, handball. Get around. Give us your balls. But, well, let me know if you need anything. I remember one time I got my, we got the vice principal to play handball with us, that was a cool day. It's a dirty trash can. It's a dirty trash can. It's a trash can full of well kept flowers. It's a source of milk. You don't want to talk to her again? Oh, alrighty then. Uh, oh, Chris. You, you, you want to talk about someone? Flowers. Oh, these flowers? That, from your dad. Right. He, he always asks how you're doing at school, and gives me a bouquet of them. Uh, actually, but he, you know, he always gives me flowers. Really makes me wonder if he, if he likes, if, 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 if he like the awesome comics I like him. <laughs> oh yeah, the What's awesome the comics. Honestly, he kind of reminds me of a superhero, Chris. He's huge and could kick my ass. Uh, I'd let him top. <laughs> Same. <laughs> chalk. C Chris, you know you never got the chalk. You deserve a reward for trying to help find it. <laughs> Thank you. So, in return, I can let you borrow um, my homemade DVD collection of the symptoms. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's like with like, the really bad kid in class does one good thing and the teacher rewards them, and yet all the kids who do good stuff constantly get the reward. I'm still fucking salty about this. <laughs> I mean, it's because it's, it's gonna reassure them that what they're doing is good. Yeah, but like, you're just putting a reward system, in which case they do something good, they deserve a reward. When what you should be teaching them is that being kind, it's nice to be nice. So, I, I just, I just want the reward. <laughs> That's all good. Also, I don't know if you've noticed, every man is like scribbled onto the wall. Every man. <laughs> like, you know, the guy in True Love. Oh yeah! Every man was part of Reaper Bird's attacks. Really? The one where he'd get like butterflies and like shoot his head at you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, the sitcom about the middle class wants a family? Yeah, yeah. It's got every episode in all 28 seasons. That's a fucking long sitcom, oh my god. 
It's the funniest, most incredible show ever. What is the longest sitcom ever, I wonder? That makes it just insane. Oh, sorry. Uh, well, so they all started diving their own motorbikes and fighting giant rickets. And maybe all about this is that they all kind of lost the focus on the family and they were about to shake like owls and they were friends with the owl vehicles. And let's like get into this, this galaxy for Let's just discover the, uh, the world, the gravitation field just. Uh, you don't want to watch it? I mean, you just kind of spoiled the whole thing, so. No, that's okay, Chris. Yeah, what's the longest one? Because Friends went for 10 seasons. That was pretty long. Oh, so, go down, because there's like still more you didn't do to the left. Like, top down dine and all that. Oh, is this not the way home? No, this is not the way home. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, it's, all it's all the way top. Oh, right. Police tape is blocking the way. The tape is simply reads, Nyeh! Sorry, I should have you do that. <laughs> I'm just like fully up. <laughs> You're not going to door to the police station. Someone's coming up to the window. <laughs> they just closed the blinds. Let me in, you fucker. Hospital. Hey, it's Audrey June. Oh, it's um, you. Are you here to play the piano again? The patients oh, yeah. can't hear it well from here, but I personally enjoy it. Turn up those things. The sliding the bead toys that naturally spawns inside the. They're only in doctor's offices. The beads march hey, grimly among the tepper. Yeah, even no. to this day, even to this oh, day, whenever I go to my local clinic for stuff, or even when someone just has to take me there with them, I still <laughs> play with that. It's fucking Same. fun. It's fun, dude. dude. Shit to capture kids' attention span captures my attention span. An obligatory what? hospital piano. It's been shrunk to fit in the corner, so it only has a few keys. Play it? Sure. Link. Link. Oh, boy. It's a diagram showing a bunch of lines and circles. Oh. Uh, I can't just say that to her. Oh my god, I'd die, I'd literally die. Oh, sweetheart. First time I laid eyes on your mother. I walked right up there and told her she was a hot piece of work. <laughs> really? Yeah, I told her how fucking fat her out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she slapped me uh, hard so I blacked out. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't help at all. Anyhow, I'll, I'll, I'll shrug and blaze this three. Are you not yet? Nah, I'm still at the ice palace. Kind of, kind of waiting to finish it with you, Dad. Oh well. So my brain just had a fucking <laughs> blank because of that statement. <laughs> oh, it's all good. Maybe you should wait. Why has Dad got a bone in his hospital room? What? Because he can. Don't worry about it. You should bring it here. I'm blood and so Oh, thank God. I thought Dad was about to be like, Hey, I'm going to die, yeah. <laughs> Fine, you win. I'll bring it next time. Oh, it's getting late. Guess I better go. I've got homework. I like how I'm just eavesdropping on this whole conversation. No, yeah, they're like looking at them. <laughs> oh, that's a good project voice. Bird guy again? What was his name? Bird, please. Um, actually, it's Birdington. Can I find him? It's, um, Birdly. It's oh, it's Birdly. Bad, bad. Um, actually, my name is Birdly. Um, oh, look what I'll, he says. I'll pick his ass. Um, actually, there's probably two because I can't fight for shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even supposed to get up. Never mind, you win. I won't kick his ass, I'll shoot him in the head. <laughs> <laughs> I got my rifle. <laughs> the, day, the, day, the day he gets out of hospital, oh well, we, we, have, we haven't smoked bird for dinner. I'm gonna oh. kill a trout. <laughs> Bring me by the window, I'll throw something at him. Goodbye, Dad. Hey, honey. Oh, bye, honey. Look. Oh, hi, Chris. Hey, you know dad? Oh, so it's a listen, but I'm... No, I'm actually gonna secretly poison you. What? Get a little friendly up. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, alright. It's an angel doll. No, it's a bong. It's like a facial features is unsettling. That angel no no and this made it up in your music. It's kind of look, it's kind of like a good luck charm to me now. Oh, right. You and Anthony try to make one too. But you're wasting the whole time making huge wings for it. 
<laughs> Patient name Rudolph Rudy Holiday. Hey, Chris. Uh, uh, my name is something. No. It's a chair. Hell yeah. It's a bunch of roses in a glass container. Hey, I'm happy you have worldly flowers, but... Ah, oh, because that's right, because you got the flower room, so he's giving everyone flowers. Zach, your mind's gonna be fucking blown in a few minutes. Oh, what God. Is this? What is this, Ben? You're a beast? That ain't gonna work, man. We're both beasts. I'm not he actually. Be. Oh, he is, but... <laughs> <laughs> No jingle my ghost on balls. Looks oh. like this escaped early. <laughs> Alright, Chris, just give me your straight shot. Give me the big shot. Why are you here? Did your love make you come here? No, completionism. Really? You've grown up a lot, Chris. I'm proud of you. Once you told me that you were just the creepy kid next door. <laughs> All right, jeez, shots fired. <laughs> now you're the creepy kid right in front of me. <laughs> okay, okay, seriously, you wanna chat or something? Sure. My goodness. She's a sweet eye, ooh, she Chris. Get ready to read, Byron. No, I was fine. Smart kid, sweet, but ask for a better daughter. It's very quick. I just wish she hasn't so the fat source. It's very baby, it's bugs, Santa Claus, everything scares her. <laughs> and you know, a big man crawled through my chimney and came to break and like, broke in my house. I that... woke up in the middle of the night. I would be slightly concerned. That is a good I point. I don't care if he was leaving <laughs> shit in my house. A, I don't know what that shit is. And B, he's in my house. It could be a bomb for all we know. <laughs> That's a good point. When you actually think about it, Santa is quite a creepy individual. When it happens, she freezes like a deer in her pipes. <laughs> freezes. Remember, <laughs> she used to be afraid of humans under the bed. Oh my god. It's, it's not nice if you were to hide under the bed, by the way. That's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow. Ooh. Anyhow, that's that's tough about being a new Chris. Go on the face. Instead, it would be time I could be there to protect her. That's why she's a snowflake, she's always had you to protect her. <laughs> yes. Keep an eye out for her, okay? I will. Bitch, bitch, okay. bitch, bitch. Illness. So, why am I in here? Do you have AIDS? <laughs> No, it's actually prostate cancer. Well, <laughs> they found some crap, so it's, so it's just some tests. Yeah, it's no big deal, nothing like a holiday can handle. I'll be out, I'll be out of, I'll be out of here in a jiff. Then I can go back to, uh, uh, you know, you youth for getting to go to no right this place. Uh... <laughs> Family. Chris, even if we've grown apart, we still love your family. After all, me and I've scored college battles, right? Hey, never. Now that Azrael's off to college. You think he's doing any crazy parties like they and your dad? Oh, <laughs> well, he's getting shit faced. <laughs> no! <laughs> what? <laughs> Sipping on all the truths. Oh great! I just remind have I just remind me of that one. Ezreal is bad as hopes and dreams and cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> the cocaine is called hopes and dreams. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm just on your leg. Your dad was no party animal. He was a party beast. Your your mother, on the other hand, whoa. <laughs> You know it's just about going, but once the party started, Jack's back. But she hit me clear across the room with a key line pie. <laughs> I got smashed into the snack table and tumbled everything. I used to buy it though, couldn't complain. <laughs> and that's about it. Oh, yes, that's just it. Alrighty. What, what the hell are you here for, Chris? To go? <laughs> yeah, I wonder how you live without any fingers. <laughs> Dude, you thought this was the zoo or something? Come on. 
All uh, right. Just... To the other room. Whoa. <laughs> it's a regular it. sink. Oh, it's the guy who got... I can't remember what happened to him. Uh, pizza-related injuries. That's right. It's a kind of other, other sink. Perhaps there was originally one tall sink that was cut in half to create both of them. Perhaps. <laughs> maybe there was. <laughs> he looks inside the cupboard. A very small obligatory piano is hiding in there. The pay meter. It's a classic 1 to 10 pain scale using IC as a model. At 0, pain, he's happy. At 10, pain, he's happy. And sweating. The gas is way too easy to regulate me to this healing chamber. But my blood is really for bad. Alright, buddy. <laughs> More! How am I supposed to get past this blue lady? I'm stuck! I guess I should just. Possibly. I guess I should just run away. What are you going to say? But each chief on dying is supposed to be directing traffic. But all she's doing is standing in the middle of the street yelling, Get out of my way! She's the best. Huh? I really feel directed. Damn. Hey, punk, get out of the road! <laughs> You're blocking the traffic! Jeez, alright. Oh, wait, it's just I look good. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little uh, worked up right now. <laughs> this job's so boring, nothing like, ever happens. Something shaking up. Maybe fixing the problem at hand? Uh, you have the Uh, sure. Alphys. Alphys? Yeah, she's doing meth in the back alley. It's Alphys. No idea who you're talking about. Why? Did they do something illegal? Gotcha. I see Alphys. I'll tackle them. <laughs> <laughs> They're as good as dead. They're not wives. Yeah, they know, what I say? They do not know each because you're right. I don't know if you're not remember and I'm dying, they know each other. Here they yeah. don't. Wait, slightly what? to the right. Yeah, you're talking to the guy. Oh, the crap. Car. Crap. <laughs> help you. Oh, you wanna help me? Sure, fuck. Get someone to rob the bank so I can suplex them. <laughs> Wait, do we even have a bank? Good question. So real. Hey, get someone to build a bank! <laughs> I just realized she doesn't have a right patch. <laughs> That's true. It's a dark world inside the school. Uh, sure. Yeah. There's no lore against dark worlds anyway. <laughs> it's a job for the school board. For real. Don't do anything illegal, you little punk. Alright. I don't even know if you get a lead on any public goals. There's one wanted on several counts of comic mischief. <laughs> I wonder who this purple girl could be. Alright, that's done, that's done, that's done. Was there any more to the right down there? Or? No, there shouldn't be. Was right. it just... No, we did all that. Yeah, yeah, that was just the apartments. Alright, that right, was... Yeah, that was... That, yep, alright. Up. <sighs> Fucking more. Let's go. Let's, let's go! All the way to this side. Oh, oh my yes. god! <laughs> <gasps> Yippee! Sand, um... Sand here for the face oh, of water. Face of water. Alrighty. Nope. Of course. I'm real popular. I just don't have any friends. <laughs> but it's okay, you hear? Because you're here, you hear? Will you be my friend? Sure. No, oh, I'm so happy, you hear? I'm so happy. I, I, I don't know what to do. I don't remember being this happy before. <laughs> What's your name, friend? <laughs> Hippopotamus. I'm Chris. Chris, that's you. That's a real nice name for a friend. Hey. Oh, excuse me, I forgot to introduce myself. Actually, since no one talks to me, I forgot my own name. Oh, no. Chris, can you give me a name? A disgusting onion. Hmm. It's perfect, you hear? I don't know what it means, but it's perfect. Hmm, feels like it's shaped like me, like it smells like me. <laughs> Wait, what was the name? Uh, onion? Yeah, it's perfect. Onion. That's my name. Hell yeah. Thank you for giving me a name. I'll cherish it, you hear? Alright, I'm Yim. Chris, this is the best name, right? Is it sure. I want to tell you something tomorrow. Something I can only tell a friend. The putties are in the lake. <laughs> Come 
come back soon when you're here. <laughs> Don't go to school tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see. All right. It's a metal picnic table. Cigarette buds lie on the ground underneath it. Stick your fingers into the holes in the table. Yes! Your fingers don't fit through the top anymore. You try from below. Your hand became covered in cobwebs. Ew. It's a metal picnic table. Cigarette buds lie on the ground. Awesome. Hello, you two! It was a dating! Like, nothing- This was the Shaggy voice I gave, right? Yeah. 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 Like, nothing better than hanging out at the lake with my best bro, watching the waves go by. Kiss, 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 kiss. <laughs> Just true. True. It's your dad's truck. The floor of the front seat is littered with old papers and country CDs. He listens to country music. <sighs> yep. Hey! Yeah, it's a flashlight oh, yeah, so now. Dum -dum -dum. Is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished the watering these flowers. Yippee, that's a florist now. That's how we got old <laughs> flowers. Nice. Yes. Here we are. Howdy, how can I... Oh, Chris. Ah! <laughs> oh, um, I'm sorry. I forgot if you don't like hugs like that. Dude, hug me as much as you fucking want. Well, now, make yourself at home, Chris. You can help yourself to anything you like. I would like some money, please. <laughs> It's a cash register, there's not much change inside. Oof. Some kind of catalogue, there's a car magazine underneath. It's a flower. Alrighty then. Whoa, that's a reference. It's a nair mattress, it's certainly not king size. Uh, Chris, do you want to sleep over? You could use that air mattress. I could, uh, use those bags of soil. Perhaps not. Ah, oh, poor Ascol. It's a small TV on top of some superhero comics, some porn VHSs. <laughs> it's a rusty fruit with some photos on it. Oh, Chris, if you're hungry, help yourself to anything you want. Open fridge. All that's inside is a jar with a single pickle in it. You decide to pass. See photos. A photo of your mother and father on their wedding day. She's holding a bouquet of seven flowers. Ooh, a reindeer looking monster stands nearby in a tuxedo. They all look happy. Don't. He decides not to look. Happy flowery. There are some dirty dirt. Happy squid work. <laughs> Stuck <laughs> fur um, in the drain. It's a door. It's locked. Alright. Flowers. It's an orange flower protected in a container. Oh, wait. It's a green flower protected in a container. It's a yellow flower also protected in a container. It's a cyan flower. Protected in a container. It is a blue flower. Protected in a container. Let me guess. It's a pink flower. Protected in a... Oh, it's a purple flower. Protected in a container. It's a golden flower. Protected in a container. So obviously, it's a reference to the six souls and hmm. flowery. It's a dirty watering can. Various bags of soil. It's a note. It says, No rent received. Again. So give me flowers. Start selling them. You have one month. Oh, I missed the name. Oh, it's C. Yes, those flowers are still kicking. Qu quite hard work to take care of them in this climate. I assume going up here will just spawn you on the other side. Yeah. Hell yeah. Say, Chris, I was uh, thinking, perhaps when Azrael comes home, we could all go to dinner like old times. My treat. Doesn't that sound yummy? No oh, uh, Chris, before you go... Give him a hug! Here. Yeah. For your mother, our secret. We've got the bouquet of flowers. Have a great day, Chris. That's the bloke. See ya, mum and dad are divorced. <laughs> yeah, he's knock knock knock. This is Metaton, actually. Oh, oh, this is Metaton. Yeah. Oh yeah, because the darling. Uh, I'm afraid no one's home now, right now, darling. Now, why don't you prance on home? No, keep talking. Keep talking, keep talking, keep talking. Again, you don't have to speak like a robot instead of a robot. Yeah. Because <laughs> that have you... been a ghost body now. Um, um, I'm gonna do the slightly better voice. I'm telling you now, they're not home right now. Uh, you just wanted to talk to me. My apologies, beautiful. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a nobody. Oh. Dr. Not. I'm telling you, they're not home right now. Ah, you just wanted to talk to me. 
My apologies, beautiful. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a nope. Oh, it's just the same shit. Come back and talk to them tomorrow. All right. Kissy, like, long time no see. What's up? Did you want to talk about something? Neighbor. Uh, the chick next door drives me nuts. I keep seeing her everywhere I go. She's a total copycat. Like, why though? She doesn't realize she'll never. Be, doesn't she realize she'll never be me? Honestly, her whole family is like so trashy. Once her sister served me a coffee, and I swear it was half caffer. <laughs> like, get a hairnet, girl, for like your whole body. Just rocks up in, like full PPE gear. Hell yeah. There's some kind of scratching noise coming from inside. No, keep talking to her. She's got my sound attack. Oh yeah. Oh fuck. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Go away. Oh, it's, it's up to your almost sister-in-law. Nah, I'm joking, but like, remember that time I played Chupa Dare with Abby? Like, I like, made him give his first kiss. <laughs> and then your mom found out he kissed someone, and... Like, I think she basically dialed no one one. <laughs> I swear, your family went to church, like, every single day that week. <laughs> Memories. Remember that time you wanted to hang out with us big kids? I was like, yeah, of course, just go get us some burgers. Then, like, amazingly, you actually got them. <laughs> so I told you to go back and get some french fries, too. And then a dozen miniature cakes. They were so good, I ate, like, six. <laughs> and I, like, suddenly got so sick, I had to go home. Man. So, like, anyway, Chris, are you busy? A uh, little. Mm -hmm. Chris, you just want to say hi. That's adorable. Now get out of here. Alrighty, hello. Hey, hey, neighbor. Be up. Oh my god. Neighbor, neighbor. Hey, neighbor, neighbor. When's your brother Doug? Doug gonna come by? Ha ha. My girls love to see him. He's a sweet little man. He's just got some one problem. Doesn't like my wife's cooking. What's wrong, Douglas? You don't like frozen cat food. Ha ha. It's a broken grill. It smells like burnt cat food. Yummy. Various cat themed junk is piled inside the house. It seems to be a bit of a catsty. Like, little Chrissy, like, what's up? Give my catty a hug. <laughs> mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> I'm not even actually your aunt. <laughs> oh my god, can I talk to you about something? Sure. Actually, like, anything though. Your choice. <laughs> Let's get going. Oh my god, as you were like, what a cutie pie. Do you remember when me and him went to the dance? That was like, the best night ever. Even though I spilled the entire punch bowl all over him. <laughs> and, dance, and dance, and dance improperly in front of your mom. He got arrested and your mom for making a scene. <laughs> <laughs> that was so much fun. <laughs> Tell him I said hi. What a great time. Oh, how's Caddy doing? I have no idea. We, like, totally can't connect at all. Yesterday, I asked if she wanted to hear me play the ukulele. She said no, and then she, like, told me my playing is a, an anti-blessing from one hell. Gosh, that's What a... the heck, Chrissy? That is a burn and a half. That's so cute. I love my fricked up little sis. Neighbors. Like that green girl next door. Oh my god, Chrissy, she's like my life villain. Like, the other day, I went to see Cat Peters too, and the only other person in the theater was her. I went to QC's on a cap, cap, cappuccino, and she's like, Are you drinking one? <laughs> she's such a copycat. A copy gator? Copy Soros? Copy Diet? I don't know, she sucked. Nothing. Oh, uh, you gotta go. Do you have like homework? Nope. You should like let me help. <laughs> it's okay. I totally don't want to. Laters. Ah, uh, Chris. Like, if you're not coming in, our cat flop is like always open to you. I mean, if I well, could. How you feeling? Yeah, not sure. <laughs> oh, hi, Chris. Did you need help with your homework again? No, I'm all good. I know you're having trouble last time, so. Um... I actually got a few things ready for you in case. Uh, wait, sorry, I can't right now. I've got my house key again. And... Sorry, Chris. I'll help you later, if that's okay. No problem. See you at school, Chris. Um, 
Marcus, did you want to talk about something? Uh, Susie. Susie? That's right, you were with Susie. When you didn't come back to class, I was worried, but everything turned out okay, I think. Um, Chris, can I ask something if that's okay? Sure. Susie, I'm kind of curious what she's like, you know? She's pretty cool. I mean, who doesn't want about her? She never talks to anyone. So, Chris, can you tell me about her? That's okay? She's nice. What? She's a nice person? Yeah, once you get to know her. R really? But, like, really? Honestly? Truly? Yeah. I mean, that's just what I was hoping, but... Oh, wait, this isn't another trick, is it, Chris? Nope. No, she like wasn't. when you put ketchup on your arms and told me it was blood? Look, she's like a cream egg. Once you can get past the hard outer shell, she's all nice and gooey inside. R really? You're serious? You're totally serious? Yep. Gus, well, maybe I should try talking to her. Give it a go. But if I die, you're paying for my funeral, Chris. <laughs> Though, honestly, if she's nice, I might die too. Alright, Susie? We just did <laughs> Oh, I thought there were multiple options about Susie. Anyway. Uh, Chris, are you feeling alright? Nope. Normally you're not so talkative. I just went to the dark world and back, so you know. Uh, I don't mean to sound like something's wrong with you. Um, Chris, is something wrong? Absolutely. I need to go to the hospital to see my dad. Why the fuck not? I mean, I'm sure you appreciate it, but, um... Gosh, I'm sorry, Chris. I figured I said anything. Look, I'm not eight years old anymore. I'm nine years old, and that's a Holy really shit. big maturity leap. Also, going <laughs> back to the dark- going to the dark world back really fucks you up. No? Why don't I ask my mum for the key? I mean, um, I- you know... She doesn't like it when I bother her when she's working. Mm. Don't worry, okay? I'll go over to Caddy's. Alright. Nothing. Tell us you I said hi, Chris. I will do. <sighs> Finally home. It's your mum's van. After a little detour. Just a tad. Welcome home, honey. Did you have fun with your friend today? I did. By the way, I just finished baking a pie. <gasps> Is it butterscotch? If you go to bed, it'll be cool when you wake. Nice. But do not eat it all this time, all right? <laughs> I'll try not to. Give, give her the bouquet. It's the TV. It doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. This book did nothing. It's a book of hymns. What about a book of hers? Chris, what is it, honey? Me! Chris, honey, you've grown up so much. No. Some days soon, you'll be going off to university as well. Hell yeah. Remember when you were little? You asked when your horns were going to grow it. <laughs> So we bought that headband with the little red horns on it. How long you wore it for months? Whatever happened to it? No idea. Asriel. Remember that video game you and Asriel used to play? It's called Undertale. Super Smash Bros. <laughs> when he was very little, he loved the green lizard from that. We even had a birthday party for him themed around it. Your father painted all those eggs with spots as decoration. Oh, your brother loved it. Until the next day, your father could come off for breakfast. <laughs> your brother just kept crying. Ever since, he hated that book about eating green eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Flowers. Oh, Chris, flowers for your mother. How sweet. These are from him, are they not? Yep. Uh, well, worry not, Chris. I will find some place for them. <laughs> like the bin. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. It's a trash can. Somehow, it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Go under the bathroom and come because back out. Of, because the flowers went there. Cookie cutters the, for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. This is all the same shit I read at the beginning of the game. Who cares? There's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. Yes, it's still cooling. Go on, mother. Sink. And what's it just come out? You look inside the sink, there's a can of Icy's Cool Boys Body Spray. Spray for the boys. Flame and hot pizza flavor. Seems to be almost entirely full. Let me drink the aerosol can. <laughs> it's a toilet. Flush it? Yes. 
keep doing it. You flush the toilet. You flush the toilet. You flush the toilet. Chris, is everything all right in there? No, I took a bunch of shit and it's not going down. <laughs> On the shower ledge is a small container of apple scented shampoo and a gallon sized container of pet shampoo. Keep doing it, no! Oh, keep doing it, alright. You flush the toilet. Look at that, I flushed the toilet. I flushed the toilet. Chris, is everything alright in there? Keep doing it. Oh god, alright. I flushed the toilet. Chris, what are you doing? I'm trying to flush the mess of shit I took. You did not put a bath bomb in the toilet again, did you? Uh, <laughs> no. Is that it? Again. Oh. Um. There's only three rounds of dialogue with it. Flush the toilet. Believe it or not, I think I flushed the toilet. Holy shit. Thank you, Foster. Flush the toilet. Damn. If anything bad happens, you're paying for the plumbing bill. That's all. Oh, yeah. It's good to conserve water, is it not? Yeah. Bin, uh, oh my god, yeah. alright. Bin. It's a trash can. Somehow, its fluorescent has increased. Yeah! There nice. are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails don't have tails. A scientific refutation. And snails help your garden? Um, not really. A signed copy by the History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boone. This cactus, there's not much to say about it. There are crayons in the drawer. The labels have long faded, and there's no green. It's only you. The door is locked. Back to bed. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jet, jazz, religious scar. There's also a game console. There's one normal controller and one knockoff one. The drawer is mostly empty, except for a sort of cross-country shirt with a tear in it. It's a beautiful day outside. Clothes drawer. It's a red bag with a rusted bird cage and it looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. I think I've read all this in the, the first part. The floor. Oh, yeah, you did. It's it's stained. Well, we've come full circle. What a lovely little adventure that was. If you go to bed, this chapter of your adventure will end. Right, is there anything more we can do? I think, this is, well, I think we've done everything in chapter one. We good? We happy? Yep, we're good. Sleepy time. Let's end the chapter. Will you go to bed? Right. Yes. Time you decided to go to bed. <laughs> no, God. Yes, it's please. 12. It's 12. It's 12, 12 o'clock hour. <laughs> It's 12, I'm hungry and I want to... No. Uh... Oh, yeah, wibbly. Little wibbly wibbly but Um... Uh, fell out of the bed, I see. What the f... What... Is... He actually just needs to pee. This is just the nighttime dis disorientation. I'm gonna get even more disoriented in a minute. Oh god. He grew fingers! Uh, I was right, the dark world really did fuck me up. I can't move. You can oh, move the the cage. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go. Chris doesn't like us. Um. When the light is running low and the shadows start to grow and 
and the places that you know uh, seem like Let's listen to a lovely little song and not think about the ending whatsoever. <laughs> There's a light inside your soul that's still shining in the cold with the truth. The promise in our heart. Oh, that was an accord pattern. Yes. Don't forget, I'm with you in the dark. To be continued next week on this channel so if you don't want to miss it please consider subscribing to the channel i really appreciate it and it really helps out S subscribe i don't do it subscribe you're gonna go in the hospital subscribe we're gonna do what chris did to his heart subscribe are you getting subscribed or you will fight shovel in the in 100 years you're not you will glue you your senile body to that computer i, I think you they've got fight shovel <laughs> I, I was a bit afraid of me. Subscribe. We love you. I hope you yeah. got the message. I'll see you guys all next week with Delta Rune Chapter 2. Goodbye. Um.